Today we're going to do a one year review of the A-Liner Scout Lite. So we made some changes on this um, on this camper. Um, there were kind of necessities, which is one is the pump. Uh, we wanted a pump uh, faucet, and I'm going to show you that in a moment. And also the bed. We wanted to make the bed a little bit bigger because um, um, it's a small bed. It's a 42 inch bed, and most people can't, you know, two people can't sleep on a on a, a 42 inch area. So we kind of enlarged it a little bit. So what, what are you going to camp in tonight? Um, I am camping in an A-Liner Scout Light. All right, show me uh, what the door looks like over here. All right, well, the door's over here. And, and this is a long space. AC that we're probably not going to use. Probably okay. never. Here's the door, but we can't open it until we actually... I'll we pop it open. So we're going to see how fast it takes us to open this up, yeah. okay? Uh, we got to be quick and like m methodical about it yeah all right see. can you handle that we'll see <laughs> now you have the off-road version but you don't have a jeep you have a car right, a sedan right so but this camper is a little bit it's lifted lifted higher off the ground so for some reason don't i don't worry about those big rocks no big rocks okay yeah lift it up And we're pretty much done. We just have to set our jacks down. And you just set it on this and you bring it down. See how fast it is? Pretty much it besides setting up the bed all right i'm coming i want to see how the bed's set up well this is the bed right now i have to get the table off of it all right so we got the the bed here it's made and then we got the couch here's the table but we have and then the window the and we have a stove okay so uh we just set up the inside of the trailer um i think it looks pretty cozy i mean this is um again it's the scout light and we did do some, uh, after camping in a couple of times, we decided that, um, cause we, we got tired of pouring the water because the trailer only comes with a hookup for your, your hose. That's it. The, the faucet does not, it doesn't pump. So we changed that. Who's in there? Hello, come on in. Okay. Tell me about what you got here. Well, I have a, uh, a-liner. You got an A-liner? A-liner Scout Light. And All right, so. I, we have the table set up with our seating. So you can put uh, two people on each side, maybe small, maybe uh, two parents. I would parents say and a... smaller people near the wall and the taller people away from okay, the Okay, and you got the windows open. It's perfect for two. You can put more in here, but it's perfect for two. All right, so you got a stove? Yeah, we yeah we have a camp stove set up for this. It's just a camp. Open that up for a second. Let's see what it looks like. Let's see, there we go. It's a two burner. All right, so a, this is a couch, and you I see you got little weird pillows here. Um, this is like for a guest. Yeah, I got some pillows already. Um, what about the water? How do you uh, do your water? Okay, so we your do faucet. our faucet, yeah, through the faucet. We get our water through the faucet. And it's basically a pump uh, water system. Yeah, you want to pump it? There's probably no water in this yet. There's no, we yeah, it. it's pointless to pump it right now because there's no water yet. But we need to get the water filled. So you like the black sink instead of a yeah, white or whatever? I like whatever. the black. I think it works. I need to clean it up, but yeah. So we have a water tank down here. Um, can you get that out for me? I, we got to yeah. fill it up anyways. So this we're going to fill up. And this is part of the system we we made yeah, underneath this sink. Um, it says 5.5 gallons. We'll probably will never use that. That's like a whole week. 
Yeah. We'll probably only we're fill only two, gallons. Like two gallons. Two yeah. gallons Just for so one we're night. Just here overnight. But there is plenty of room down here, right? Um, you could uh, put plenty of room. Like you can also put a cooler in there besides this water. Maybe depending on how much room. Um, I think so. A small cooler. All right. So we have this gallon, and we have a pump, and I had to put uh, weights on it because the weights uh, help keep the water in down to the, the bottom hose. of this. Yeah. Otherwise, the hose actually floats, which is kind of weird. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty weird. Uh, what about the lights? Turn the light on. Let's see how bright it is. Yeah, the lights work really They're well. all LEDs in this all thing. LEDs. Everything's That's LED. Really so we got to fill up this and um, we'll talk about that. So what did you... What I like, what I really like about this trailer is uh, how light and how low profile it is on the freeway. And I'm able to do 70, 75 miles an hour. Yeah. And that makes a difference when you're driving. Our fuel economy was definitely pretty good. Oh, excellent. Yeah, excellent. But I mean, you look up at this and we have an eight foot ceiling. So you got eight foot ceiling and I can stand up and change clothes. And you have a table, we have seating, and that also turns into a bed. So we got a bed, you got a sink, a stove, and another couch or bed here. You can also have someone sleep here. Yeah. Uh, we also have a fan to bring in right now it's on it's a, the, a fantastic the fan. fantastics yep so it works really good bringing the cool air in so if you buy a light a scout light i would suggest um changing the faucet over because this pump action is actually yeah. a lot better and it works pretty darn good it also works um with the hose you can actually hook up the hose and you keep it you keep it up right Terry and then you push it down to get water yeah you With keep the hose. it down I think you push it up to get water yeah so it's it works both out. ways it's a two system thing yeah. these are uh, 14 inch tires with aluminum rims which is great which is excellent yeah does it make it lighter <laughs> you don't know if it makes I, it lighter I don't know <laughs> um, the jack is really cool these things you can actually lift up the trailer almost off the ground with these so these are pretty, pretty, pretty strong. These are strong. So those are awesome. The jacks are awesome. It levels this whole thing out. The really weird thing is that this trailer comes with a leveling system, uh, little meter, and it never moves. It's always, the bubble's always there. So that doesn't work. We have a really big window. Um, which is great because it helps bring in that air, that cross breeze that you need. Uh, but look at how small you are. You're five foot two, and look at it. Look at the peak in that. That is so tall yeah. up. It's so you really can. It's way out there. Although, although the floor is up here around my knees. Yeah, it's around your knee, and it says uh, water outlet. We're gonna have to uncover that. We have a drain. Oh, we yeah we do. We have a drain. So we have to take that drain off. Yeah. Um, that cap has to come off. I'll get that in a moment because we can't put anything down the sink without that gone. Yeah. Um, this is your shore power right here. We didn't bring that cord with us because, um, or the hose, because we knew we weren't gonna, you know, take it. So she's undoing the uh, the drain so we can start dumping our water. And the hose is inside. We have a hose that hooks up to that. So these are really big windows. They do get hot. These get hot. They are plastic, but um, even with the plastic, they're pretty durable and they'll last a long time. We did buy a, uh, a cover for this. Yeah. So the cover protects all of the trailer and it keeps this, um, you know, in the silicone sealants, it'll last a lot longer. But good thing there's a, there's a screen inside, like a little curtain. Yeah. When you move your trailer around, it's only 1,100 pounds. So um, moving it around your yard is not is not a, a hard task. It actually is not too bad. There's about a hundred and fifty pounds up on the front tongue and a lot of it has to do with this battery here. Um, I did add a little toolbox that it kind of loose right now. I don't know why it's loose, but um, I'm gonna have to tighten it up before we leave. Uh, we also have the aluminum rock guard and again everything is LEDs so it's it's pretty nice. So um, some of the key features that we really like about this trailer is just the fact that it's um, aerodynamic and you can set it up to where it's 
it's you can stand up in. I mean, it's pretty roomy in there for such a small little box. Yeah. Um, it is seven foot wide by nine and a half foot long, which is a pretty good size. It's a pretty good size. I, I actually, I actually like the size of it. And the room inside is amazing. I love the room, the storage. We don't even have those storage bins filled. Yeah, not nearly filled. We didn't bring our toilet because we didn't need to. There's one here at the campground. All right, so Terry, what did you not like about this besides the small bed? I mean, it's, it is crammed. Me and her can sleep on it, but you don't have a lot of elbow room. Um, and yeah. we prefer to sleep together on the same bed. I imagine if it's a hot day and I don't want to sleep next to a hot body, I got to sleep on the couch, which has got plenty of room. Yeah, the only other thing I, I don't like so much is that the space, like he was saying, it's a little cramped. So when you're sitting at the dining table, where you're there's it's just really hard to fit four people without hitting your head against the wall because it the wall comes at you like this so, and there's um when we sleep there you can actually hit your head we've uh, done that you can see and i'm gonna show you now here's the place here so you have 42 inches from that corner to this corner and a lot of times at night you'll bump your head here not a big deal and we um, extended it out a little bit. I'll show you that photo, how we extended it out a couple inches out more. But it is a small area. Definitely one person can sleep here easily, real... Um, I mean, they would be very comfortable. And these cushions are very comfy. They're very comfy cushions. Oh, yeah, thick. Yeah, I approve the kitchen. The AC doesn't work that great. Uh, we had it on once. Remember at the... In, Phoenix. Oh, right. It doesn't work that great, but it still works. Not it that great. It was Phoenix though, so it was very hot down there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, there's tons of storage down here and in there. We have a bag. So this is very comfortable too for one person. Easily can sleep here. And again, the head should go by this way and put your feet down here because otherwise you're going to bump into this. On this side, you don't have a choice. You have you both have a countertop to hit your head in. Um, you don't do it too often. Once you realize where it is, then it works out great. Otherwise, this is a pretty nice uh, trailer. Um, I've actually enjoyed camping in this the yeah. several times we did. It's um, it's lovely. It's comfortable. The seats, yeah, are pretty comfortable here. I feel good right here sitting yeah. here. Uh, why don't you go get me lunch and bring it in, and uh, sure. we'll start eating it. Absolutely. Get it shortly. <laughs> It also is um, very um, like desert rock. There, it's very no, it's sturdy. It's really sturdy. Yeah, very which sturdy. Is nice. um, but I think it's I think it's good. So, what do you have for uh, lunch today? This is a chicken tuna salad sandwich. Or it's just a tuna fish salad sandwich. Oh, all right. <laughs> Mine kind of fell apart, but I will be I grabbing it. I thought this was it. chicken. It's tuna is this fish. Tuna fish. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought it was chicken. All right, so yeah, it's tuna, tuna fish. fish. Uh, we've already. She's already washed her hands. Yeah, I washed my hands. And this works after with seven this pumps soap. and the water comes out. It doesn't take much, see? Yeah. Water comes out. There it goes. Yep. This. Um, I don't know if we leave it in the down position or up. I don't know um, what's the best. Yeah, if, well, up, I think the water comes out. But we have a beautiful view out there. And you could probably hit your head up here, but I mean, nobody's going to be sitting back here. Looks kind of neat, the bubble. Yeah, I like the bubbles. This does the same thing, it goes down. But again, the fabric. This is like a UFO. All right, we're gonna do some hiking in the campground, but is there anything else you wanna say about this trailer for your little one-year review? It's a comfortable trailer, and um, I mean, for the size of this, and we got a pretty good deal, I think. We traded in our 109, yeah. so um, that was a great trailer too. But this one gives me uh, ability to stand up. Yeah, that's the biggest thing for him is standing up. Standing up and aerodynamic. I mean, it cuts the wind. It's it's not much taller than the car. I mean, it just goes right through. It really does. Really nice. Yeah. And it's it's perfect for two. Just perfect. You can't have more. Or three. Three people. Or three. You can't have more. <laughs> but, <laughs> you know, put the smaller people near the sides. 
of the, the walls. Yeah, because these, um, I mean, I can stand up, I can sit right here. Actually, when you do open this up, I can sit, yeah. it allows a little more space. And I'm six foot two, for so I can actually sit here and then enjoy it. It's yeah. not a big deal. Yeah, so that's It's true. really, really yeah. good. Perfect for me. Uh, the stove works good, so we're going to have what for lunch? Uh, we're going to have sandwiches. Um, sandwiches, we're going to have yeah. sandwiches for lunch. Chicken uh, salad. All right, sandwich. so we're going we're gonna to go make that. Um, but this is really um, the end of this review. We just wanted to do a quick review, so don't get us wrong that this trailer, you know, we didn't talk enough about it. Um, honestly, we don't know what else to talk about this trailer. It is really, it's, it's insulated. The, the walls are two inches thick, okay? The fiberglass paneling is built pretty nicely. The silicone is really sealed. It's, it's perfect. Um, I haven't seen any blemishes outside at all. No. And this isn't brand new. We bought this uh, used. Yeah, but it is an awesome used trailer. I think it's uh, I think it's great, and I love sleeping in it. I love cooking in this thing. Yeah. So um, at least you can cook now. Yeah. And the one nine, this the countertop was up here, so she was cooking like it this. It was just, it was also a sports um, trailer. So it, was it was off road. It was off road, so it was tall. It was taller. This and is I off could, road. I I'm not tall, so I could not get up and work the stove. But here, here can, I can do it. No easily, yeah. easily. So make sure you check out our other videos. We have um, other camping videos. If you're an Arizona, um, there's plenty of different campgrounds that we're going to be doing. Uh, we'll be going to Mount Graham uh, next year. So we're going to do eight yeah. or whatever different campgrounds up there. Yeah. Um, that's the fourth highest uh, peak in Arizona. Beautiful mountain range. Humongous. Oh, yeah, it'll be amazing. Um, we will not have this camper. We will probably do tent. What do you say? Thanks for watching, right? Yes. Okay. All right, everybody. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Can you tell me what would you bring today to camp in? To camp in? Yeah. What did you want to camp in today? I brought an Air A Liner Sport. A Liner Sport. Is that what you're trying, trying to ask? What Terry, you're asking me? This is this is A Liner like Scout. Oh, I'm sorry. The Sport is the last one you owned. <laughs> Um, we're gonna go visit. Uh... What the hell is this place? I don't place? remember the. This, what? Don't what remember. is this? Where are we? Damn it! Shh, I mean. I don't remember. Okay. So are you want me to look it up online? Lakeview. <laughs> Lakeview. All right, hold on. Composure. All right, so we're here at Lakeview Campground. Oh. Can you see if it's 14 or 15s? Oh. What does this say right here? 14s. See aluminum rims. Just say aluminum rims and 14 inch. 14 inch. These are uh, 14 inch tires with aluminum rims. Which is great. Which is excellent, yeah. Does it make it lighter? <laughs> you don't know if it makes I, it lighter. I don't know. <laughs>